Hey everybody, I wanted to share with you real quick, Adam Nimoy, son of the late great Leonard Nimoy, just got married to Terry Farrell, who played Jadzia Dax on Deep Space Nine. They got married in San Francisco on Leonard Nimoy's birthday, March 26th. It was a simple civil ceremony at City Hall. They first announced their engagement at a Star Trek convention back in 2017. Adam Nimoy has directed a lot of stuff, including a bunch of episodes of Star Trek The Next Generation. A few years back, he decided he wanted to work on something with his father, and this led him to directing For the Love of Spock, a doc about Spock. He says his dad, Leonard Nimoy, was into the idea of doing a Spock doc when he brought it up. Leonard actually mentioned he had recently googled Spock's ears and found to his delight that there were 150,000 websites that mentioned his ears. Working on the documentary led Adam Nimoy to research the mesmerizing effect Spock had on women, and this led him to the Deep Space Nine episode, Trials and Tribulations, where Sisko and Dax and friends end up on Kirk and Spock's Enterprise back in the time of Tribbles. There's a scene where Dax says, oh, he's handsome, and somebody says, Kirk? And she says, no, Spock. Adam Nimoy decided to use that scene in the Spock documentary, and I think that's what led to him meeting Terry Farrell. Terry Farrell was actually suggested for the part of Jadzia Dax by Marina Sirtis, who played Deanna Troy. The two of them were friends before Deep Space Nine was developed. She says she used to identify with Spock when she was an outsider as a kid, and she was thrilled to play the science officer on Deep Space Nine because that was Spock's job on the first Star Trek. Adam Nimoy is a self-described pop culture junkie, and he talked about how his father was always amazed at what an influence on pop culture Spock had had. Leonard's family, his wife and kids, were always interested in his latest role when he was starting out as an actor. He was a frequent guest in a lot of shows before he was on Star Trek. His family really liked Spock because he was such a good guy and he had had more than a few turns playing bad guys already. Here he is in Dragnet as Julius Harvey Carver, an 18-year-old criminal who gets to ask Officer Friday, what's the beef? And here he is as Ray on Highway Patrol, also a bad guy. Gene Roddenberry wanted Leonard to play Spock after working with him on The Lieutenant, the first show he created. Leonard didn't really think anything would come of it when his agent first told him Roddenberry was interested in him for the part. He was pleasantly surprised when he went to meet Roddenberry and realized he wasn't even being asked to audition. Roddenberry started showing him around the sets they were building and the wardrobe department, and it dawned on Leonard that he was being offered the job and all he had to do was keep his mouth shut. The Spockumentary, For the Love of Spock, looks like a great documentary. I haven't seen it yet, but I'd really like to. Here's wishing you all the best, you two. Live long and prosper.